Agent Carter, report to the engineering wing. William Carter to the engineering wing. Fuck you. Make it quick. That's all for now. Thank you, sir. And keep up the good work. There are a lot of people out there who need you. I will. Ugh. Who are you? Looking for a few answers? If you get any insights, let us know. Will do, Carter. There's so many people talking, it's crazy. Carter, join me. Join you. Why can't I go into can't get into any of these rooms? We need to have a talk, Carter. Fucking calm down. I don't like it when my agents go off the rails, Carter. Never ignore my orders again. You're lucky things turned out as well as they did with Dr. Weir's rescue. I'll overlook it this time. I understand the situation is getting to you. Weaver tell you that? Or you just figured it out on your own. I need to know I can trust you, Carter. I took a big risk including you in this operation. And I'm about to take another. What is he talking about? When did I disobey an order? Oh, in the, in the first mission. Okay, I got you. In case you forgot, I was the one who caught the infiltrator. I'm well aware, and you're going to help us interrogate the captain. But we absolutely cannot afford another breach, especially not now. We can't afford to let any of our information become public. I've been wanting to have a talk with that infiltrator. There's a lot we can learn from him, but right now, there's one piece of info that could help us end the war. What's that? Where to strike. Impressive, but can it win the war? It can give us a fighting chance. What do we know about the infiltrator? We've been running a barrage of tests on it. Preliminary interrogation, medical checks. The boys in the lab even took a look at the devices implanted in him. Find anything useful? We don't even know his name. Or if his kind even have names. But we have reason to believe he'll be more responsive now. What happened? Lock him in solitary for a couple weeks? You might be closer than you think. In a recent examination, our surgeons removed this from his head. We think it's some kind of communication device. He was bugged? We're not sure. Weir thinks it was his connection to Mosaic. That's their communication network. According to Dr. Weir, yes. Whatever it is, ever since we removed this thing, the infiltrator's been less aggressive, more morose. Interesting. How do we know we can take them out in one strike? Weir's been studying their transmissions, and he believes they're coming from a single source. That's this mosaic thing they talk about? Yes. The doctor says his measurements prove that it's some sort of central command, possibly even a single being. And if our tests are correct, it is indeed more than just some sort of radio network. How so? After studying the infiltrator's implants and physiology, we believe it connects directly to the minds of the outsiders. So if we take out Mosaic's core, we shut down every outsider on this planet. That's the idea. But we need to know more. Well, that's convenient. That's an impressive flying saucer you've built. Actually, the Air Force was already toying with a prototype like this. Our German associate just made a few modifications including everything we could steal from the Outsiders. How does it handle? When it's finished, it'll be faster and more maneuverable than anything in the skies. Can I get through those Ven gates of theirs? That's what we need you to find out. 
I'll see what I can get out of the infiltrator. Good. We've got him in a containment center in the lab, built especially for him. Got his own luxury suite, huh? That ought to soften him up. Don't count on it. How gentle do I need to be? Just be careful. He's the only captive we have. I like how the thing is just lying there. Oh, the door's open now. So it can move in any direction? Like a helicopter? Yes, if a helicopter was twice as durable, five times faster, and could fly through a vacuum. Ah, that makes quite a difference. Shut it down! Shut it down before it blows! No, wait! We need to test the thresholds! Yes, we really should see when it explodes. Are you two crazy? Shut it down! Did you see that lift? Wunderbar. Never before have I seen it equal. Sure, Wunderbar. Locked up for interrogation. So, the one place we know is safe. The laboratory. The fuck? Pretty soon we're gonna know the fucking uh economics of the fucking aliens. These are so not interesting to read. I have a big problem with games like just scatter notes like this around. Or like those audio logs. Like I like the audio logs in System Shock 2. Because there are, I don't know, it's like because of that. In System Shock 2, you're the only character alive. So it was like a haunted haunted house type you know story so it makes sense to get the story through you know audio logs but in this game having these fucking recordings just lying around is very uh lazy Rationality will not help us identify enemy infiltrators. Blah blah blah. blah. Tests on men, like livestock. These tests serve to protect oh, them. And after all, they are all volunteers. Maybe, but we're still not certain of what side effects. And plus, these audio logs, like, they're in the same volume level as, like, like all these fucking random. Not random, but like in all these other like conversations, so it's hard to hear. Like with System Shock 2 or like any of the Bioshock games, when you click on the audio log, it's like it's the loudest thing. It takes center stage. But see, like, yeah, here it's like the audio log's still going on. I can barely hear because I'm so far away. So it's like. It makes me even less. Sectopod, what is that? Oh, the sectopod was the big thing. Power armor. Oh, I know it could be nothing. Some Soviet trick, perhaps. A 
Ah, William. Welcome to our newly refitted laboratory. I'm certain that Dr. Veer would love to give you a tour of the facilities. Yeah, Herr Doctor? Yes, of course. I'll just leave Heinrich to his tests. What are you doing? It's like he's radiating his balls. Oh, turrets. That's actually a pretty neat layout. What was that? Gunship. See, like, again, with, the, like, these notes, why come? It would be so much more easy to read if these notes were, like, you know, in a collected spot. I mean, sure, it makes sense to have them scattered in the, in the lab, but... I don't want to have to go fucking hunting for these things. Talk to you first, I guess. Heinrich, weren't you? I could have sworn you were down there. Oh, fuck you. What did you want to talk about? Yes, we've had a bit of a mishap, William. Ah, oh, great. As you know, our most pressing goal is to develop a test to determine the uh, humanity of our personnel, if you will. We've had a breakthrough. Discovering a signal which causes the zilicoids to become quite agitated. But as you can see... Your test subjects escaped? Indeed. Perhaps the signal agitated them a bit too much. Why haven't we been put on alert? Mit our current tension, can you imagine how people would panic? I'd rather we keep this little incident between ourselves, William. What exactly do you need me to do? The zilicoids are likely to be hiding in the ventilation or other subsystems. Their distinctive trail should make it easy for you to track them, or destroy them. Good hunting. What the fuck? Okay. Note. Blow me. The infiltrator's right inside, Agent Carter. Need anything? Just ask. Oh, I thought that pipe led out here, so. Let's look for this, uh, psilopod thing. Looks like I found the first of Heinrich's blobs. 